What's going on guys? Vic DP back with another Game Case Arcades video. On this one today, we got Time Crisis 5 working with the aim track. Try to do a cool intro with like the Time Crisis logo and everything, and this beast of a PC just boosts this game up like it's nothing. Um, so, uh, just a quick heads up, let me lower the game audio. Brand new game, just came out, Time Crisis 5, it is an actual arcade game, not using Techno Parrot, thank god. This is on its own, I have this in my Tato Type X wheel, uh... It just got released maybe about two days ago, but there is a gentleman by the name of Brad. I don't want to butcher your name, but I'm definitely going to put his link in the description below. Brad Diedrich. Um, got to check out his YouTube channel because he figured out an amazing AHK to get the aim track working beautifully on this. Big shout out to Brad. There's a whole commotion, commotion he's got going on. Haters hating all the time, but Brad, Vic VP here. Giving you big kudos, man, for getting the aim track to work. Obviously, we have this on Eugene's bar top. Brand new, just installed, using Brad's AHK file, also with a combination of joy to key We have the arcade sticks using basically the coin. Um, we are also using the enable cursor mod from Brad, and we are also using the mouse wheel scroll um, as far as in this game, there's an actual option to change from a handgun to a machine gun. And we are also using the aim track red buttons. Might as well get, might as well get the aim track here. We are using the aim track red buttons as this new time crisis has a left and a right kind of dodge and hide thing going on. Never seen this in the arcade, but biggest thing, biggest shout out to all the emulation world. They got it up, and again, shout out to Brad for his AHK file, making it work with aim tracks. Uh, for right now, this is a one-player game. I believe the two-player is like an actual computer link kind of thing. At least we got one player working. Let's do a little bit of a gameplay and check it out. So obviously right now, as you can see, I do have Eugene's bar top right next to me. I have my screen right in front of me, so my aim is going to be off. Um, but... Let's get into it. So pressing coin one automatically brings it. There is no start button. I'm using my aim track here. And the big thing about this game was that the aim track was functioning here in the menu. But once it got in the game, it kind of freaked out. It kind of spazzed out. So with Brad's help on his AHK file uh, and basically modifying a, I believe it's a .dll base input file inside the game, we are able to enable mouse and the sensitivity. Basically, like the, the sensitivity was just wild. So right now, you guys don't see a, a crosshair on the screen. I'm gonna basically press button one on the arcade stick, and now we have a crosshair. And again, I'm using the left to pop up. And if I go right on the aim track, I lost my crosshair, you go left and right. So using the red buttons, left and right. Let's get some gameplay going. We're gonna bump the volume here. Now, as far as the skip on this, it's the select button for me. Um, the select button also is the mouse wheel. I'm sorry, not select. It's it's the start button. Sorry about that. Start button is the wheel. So here we go. Going to bounce around. So as you can see, we do have crosshair on. Bounce around. Very cool game. Very cool. Definitely with the aim tracks. I'm getting a text right now. Okay, here we go. So, still have the crosshair up. Oh, come on. Awesome. And as you can see, again, using the aim track, you can see how I'm playing this. I'm getting it done, though. Here we go. This is a, a amazing graphics on this game. We're right in the head. I'm going right for the boss. Oh. I almost shot my partner. 
reload. So again, button one enables the um, crosshair. So if I press button one, my crosshair now is gone, making this game really kind of difficult to play. You're better off launching the crosshair. Oof. He's just taking my bullets. Again, yes, I'm playing awkwardly. Oh, that's right in the face. Come on. Definitely want to get to a part to at least show off the wheel. Oof. I got to turn my body. <laughs> we got six headshots. Not bad. Again, man, shout out to Brad, dude. Shout out to the community. Emulation community. It's amazing. I have mine set to 0 0.06 on sensitivity. Brad had his set to 0 0.05. Like he wrote in his post, you got to play with it. Do it for yourself. Test it out. Okay, great. I haven't played this. This is literally my first run right now. Oof. Good stuff. Using the right button on the aim track to dodge this helicopter. Oof. What? What is this? Yo. We are going some slow motion. Oh. Shit, my, my arm hurts. <laughs> Oof. Died. Let's get a coin in. Tell you one thing. This is way different than Time Crisis 1 and 2 right here. Amazing game on this. Again, Eugene's PC killing the game right now. Oof, my arm, my left arm. It's only because of the way I'm turned. When do I get like a new gun? <laughs> Don't have a gun yet, so hopefully something happens soon. Shoot him. <laughs> Shoot the markers, got it, okay. This is gonna be hard. Come on, come on, come on. Nice. So as you can see, with the sensitivity, you do have a little bit of a shake going on. Oh, I missed. Crap. It's all right. If I was standing, but I'm not going to make any excuses. Oh, yes. Do we get guns now? Okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay. So now if I press... I want the machine gun. Oh, yes. There we go. Select key, switch to machine gun, shotgun, grenade launcher. You can't just keep pressing it rapidly. You have to kind of give it a break. Probably takes about a couple of seconds. There we go. So again, using the select. Wow. I'm just holding the trigger right now. I'm praying right now. Let's do it. We got some ammo falling from the sky. Hell yeah, I'm gonna continue. No, not the handgun, boo. It's almost like you can't have any other button held down. So I was holding down like the left. But again, start button is my wheel mouse up. Oh my god. Yo, switch to switch the grenade launcher. They should really let me switch while I'm... Come on, come on. Grenade, here we go. It doesn't even want me to... Oh, well, it, did, it took a beating. Oh, I went to handgun, no. Come on, come on. I got gotcha. you. There it goes. I lost my crosshair, I see it now. <laughs> There's so much action. We are we are fighting crime. <laughs> but there you guys have it. Time Crisis 5. Aim tracks. Brad dude. 
Thank you, bro. Eugene also gives you a big shout out. Time crisis. Still, I'm going to shoot through the smoke right now. They don't want this smoke. They don't want the smoke. <laughs> there you go. That, there you guys have it. Now, also, real quick. Real quick, also using the AHK file, we have the exit button set up to exit. So if I hold it down, again, I have my exit set up to hold down for about three seconds. I exit. And real quick, while we have it, we have to give him a big shout out. Here is his YouTube channel right here. It literally says Brad on it. Everything you need is here. Brad, again, Vig VP here giving you a shout out, bro. Thank you.